I'm Quinn Connell and I edited the title sequence for the World Athletic Championships Oregon 2022. In this video, I'm going to go over the early stages of a project like this, the brand guidelines that I had to follow, and how an organization of this caliber actually manages their image. When I first started working on this, there was already a huge amount of branding work created for the event. There was the main logo, as well as a secondary branding design known as the Oregon Tapestry. Both of these had extensive brand guidelines and were created to be extremely flexible and work pretty much anywhere. But let's back up. What the heck is a brand guidelines sheet? World Athletics is a massive, global entity and not only maintains all the rules and parameters for dozens of sports, but also pours a ton of money into the second largest sporting event next to the Olympics. Their name is always floating from events to merch to web design and app development, passed around from designer to programmer to coordinator in dozens of different languages. To keep all of this wrapped up in a recognizable package, a document is created that outlines usage guidelines and proper brand representation. Presentation. The document has a lot of paragraphs eloquently waxing about brand values, and there are some real highlights of over-description here. This is all patently ridiculous, but it's useful as a sort of FAQ for the tangled and easily distracted mind of a professional designer. The most important thing here for me is the intent behind major branding elements and how they imagine they'd be animated. They say that the arcs of the logo represent the world, America, Oregon, and Hayward Field as, quote, waves radiating from the heart of the track and field universe in 2022 to the global audience. Okay. They also say that the heart of all design should be, quote, bold colors, exciting movement, and a high energy subject which come together harmoniously through attention to balance, proportion, pacing, and cadence. Okie dokie. I used this to make a storyboard and pitch for my concept of a high energy fluid sequence that used the momentum of athletes and the Oregon Tapestry design as a backdrop in order to connect this event to the spirit of Oregon. The next step was finding the music, which you can check out in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.